of God that God provides through his own dear son, the Lord Jesus Christ, who is very God, who is yep, very bro. man, who came to save us sinners. Thank you. Thanks, man. Thanks. The Bible says in 1 John, I want you to hear this. In 1 John it says that if we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. Anyone here today that says that they have no sin? Well the Bible says that all of us have sinned. We've all sinned, every one of us. We have sinned. But the good news is, it goes on to say that if we confess our sin, He is faithful and just to forgive us our sins. Know this, there is forgiveness of sins for each and every one of us here today. There's not a person passing by here today who is not a sinner and who does not need forgiveness of those sins. As you walk past today, I'm sure your conscience will tell you that you are guilty of sin. And before Hail Holy Satan. God, you stand guilty. But the good news is, you don't have to remain living with that guilt and shame of your sin. You can put your trust in the Lord Jesus Christ, in that finished work of the cross and his shed blood, and you can be cleansed, forgiven of your sins. Isn't that good news? As you walk past, don't you know that you're a sinner and you need to be forgiven? Well, I know that you know that you need forgiveness. And God is waiting and willing for you to come to him through his son the Lord Jesus Christ and receive forgiveness of your sins what a good God we have a holy God righteous just and perfect in all his ways and he wants to cleanse us from our sins so that we can come into his presence and live with him for all eternity I'll take it back now to the Old Testament where Isaiah wrote these words it says this is what God is saying to each one of us today it says come now let us reason together says the Lord though your sins be like scarlet they shall be as white as snow though they are red like crimson they should be as wool did you hear that God is saying that if you come to him and reason with him, talk to him, confess your sins, that today your sins will be forgiven. You will be washed and you will become as white as snow. There is forgiveness of our sins in the Lord Jesus Christ. I urge you today, as you walk past and you hear the word of God, you know that you're a sinner and that you believe in the Lord Jesus Christ, I urge you to cry out today and say, Lord, have mercy upon me, a sinner. I've sinned against you, I've sinned against heaven, I've sinned against people, and I'm sorry for my sins. I urge you today to turn, to repent, to have a change of heart and a change of mind, and to go the different direction that you're going in today. Stop living for self. Turn around and go God's way. Turn to God today through His Son, the Lord Jesus Christ, and put your trust in Him. He will welcome you with open arms. You may think you're unworthy of salvation. You may think you're unworthy of a holy God hugging you and embracing you with His love. But know this, that God loves you just as you are. As you walk past today, the state you're in, God will accept you as you are today. A sinner, filthy, as rags, 
He will accept you if you come to him. I urge you, come today in Jesus' name. Thank you. Amen.